So I'm gonna do more of my single player file, which I'm saying is like a beginner friendly playthrough. Um, I'm not the biggest expert, but at least I'm hoping that maybe by me talking about stuff, it might help someone. Just starting out. Plus, I wanted to check out some of the stuff that uh, might not happen because <laughs> of multiplayer. Anyway. Summer. Alright, so you can get accustomed with what I'm doing. So I think last time I had a fish pond that was being built, which had a sturgeon in there that's going to come out. Um, sturgeon give the best kind of row, which you can make um, caviar out of. Good money source. Um, I bought the sturgeon early because I wanted to get it up as soon as possible. Um, could have waited because the sturgeon is available in summer, but it's like It'll still be a couple of days before I'll be able to even consider it, purely because day one is just going to go to setting up the crops. That's without question. And then the second day, I guess, is kind of getting accustomed to everything. So it'll still be a while. At least this way, I don't have to go out of my way to fish and I can try and progress other things. So that's why I chose that. But you can wait till summer to set that up. Alright, so in this first week, the only birthday is Jazz's, so that's the only thing I have to worry about. Everything else is kind of clear. Um, so yeah, it's, I guess the thing that I'm going to focus on this first week of summer will be getting the barn with some animals. Um... And then potentially progressing a bit further in the mines and stuff. There'll be some fishing along the way, um, getting the requirements for the bundles, but I'll try not to do it too much, but, you know, it's still a good source of money. Let's see. Yeah, okay. So I have to make sure these are planted. So summer squash is something that I did find seeds for. That's no problem. Um, yeah, I could probably do some of this. Okay, summer foraging is that. That's pretty straightforward. Let's see. For that fish... Doesn't look like that one's available this season. This one looks like it's a full one. Um, walleye? No walleye either. Full. Specialty fish, maybe if I upgrade my axe we might be able to get that. That, that's a summer thing. And... Yep, okay, so we can finish this one. Okay, so it looks like ocean fish is probably the priority. There are some exclusive fish that aren't in the ocean, but there's not too many. Um, But yeah, mining because I want to get this going. And all I really need is just the gems. I'm actually doing all right. All right. This is the one thing I appreciate about single players. Like, I can plan out what I'm going to do. I can stop and think. <laughs> Which I'm a bit better when, when I do that. All right. All right, Demetrius. Yeah. So here's the thing about this is, like, every time I play this... I pick one or the other, the options that he gives you. But every time I do it, like, someone asks me why I picked that option, or why didn't I pick the other option. Um, okay. Spare the technical details, you know, the empty caves over in the cliffs. Love way to turn it into something both useful for us. I like to set up 
to attract local species that, that can observe them. Basically, he wants to put bats in there. Yeah, like bats or mushrooms. So, I've always leaned towards fruit, but it's kind of like... It depends on your bundles. The stock bundles, I think, benefit more from fruit. Um, but mushrooms are also a good source of food, and there's a new there's new items that kind of make either of these better. I'm gonna go with the the fruit though. I still feel like they have more value, but I think it comes down to personal preference. Anyway. Let's get some groundwork done. The first thing you should do at the start of every season is just check that there isn't anything that is going to damage any of your your crops or your your flooring. Um, so it's just stone and stray pieces of wood and um, these things as well. Fiber. Parsnip soup. Alright. Give me fried eel. Alright, um. Okay, so. Gotta make sure that I'm always smelting. Um, do I have bait for my crab pots? Let's see. I need to make more bait. So a lot of this is going to be mixed seeds. I also have mixed flower seeds, which are useful. But I think I'm going to use those in fall. Um, 21 mixed seeds. That should cover me, I think. And then we can see what we're missing at the end. Think what else I might need that. Okay. I will need to set up a worm bin. Then I don't have to worry about bait. Uh where oh the bug bait's already come back. Let's see if I have that recipe. Worm bin. Okay, so hardwood, gold bar, iron bar, fire bar. I do have that. It's worth setting this up if you're doing crab pots. And then fire bar. Okay. It's just going to give me bait, so then I don't have to stress about that. Um, I'll probably set up a little spot that's right in front of uh, the crab pots themselves so then I don't have to walk too far and it's kind of a morning ritual thing. The one thing about this is... Um, It's kind of hard to tell, like, what these seeds became, unless you have that deep of a knowledge of what the seeds look like. I wish you could hover over it, and, I mean, I'm sure there's mods for for this exact thing. But just being able to know what exactly is planted there. Anyway. Refill. Oh, got my first maple syrup. That will probably go to make a beehive. Instead of the bundle stuff. Just to get another source of income. I'm going to keep the farm plot the same size as last season. Just not too big. 
keep it manageable so then I can focus on other things and not have most of my energy be wasted. Well, used. It's probably the better word. Alright. Um, I need wood to be able to make a beehive, so I'm probably going to try and cut some trees down if I can. Guess I'll put it away for now. I put that sturgeon in there so then nothing bad happens. Alright, uh, before I go into town, let's have a quick look that nothing is going to damage my buildings. I think it should be fine. It's just up here I have to worry about. Okay. Uh, four... Eleven. Eleven seats. I have eleven spots left, so I'll go buy something from Piers. So there's no foraging thing um, that's constant in summer, so I don't have to do like the spring onion thing that I was doing in spring. That's gone now, so we don't have to do that daily lap thing. Good to know Marnie's here, so I can't buy animals. I do need to do that. Um, okay. So, I am going to get one sunflower seed so I can grow a sunflower. I'm gonna get um honey. And then I guess I need to make sure okay, so hops definitely is something that the mixed seeds don't give. I'm gonna buy five. That should be enough. Okay, so that's six. We need to make sure... This is a nice and cheap one, so I'll get... These will be like my replacement growth ones. Um, what have I got left? I got 240. So, pepper is a good one because you can give that as presents. Um, can go for the melon, but... I'm going to go for things that replenish when you grow them. So I think these two will be fine. Hopefully I'll get some radishes out of it. If I don't, I can grow them later. So again, like the previous season, I'm going to make sure that I grow, I'm grow. i growing one of every crop. And then at the end, I'll get the seeds. So then when the greenhouse pops up, I'll work on the 15 of every crop thing. So I'd say, this, it's not bad. I didn't have to spend much money. And got decent. Which is, uh... Yeah, that's the importance of getting mixed seeds. Alright, I'm gonna put them here. I will put the... Okay, I need to be careful with how I do this. But the way I'm going to do that, I'm gonna separate this entirely. Because I don't want to accidentally harvest it. So what I'm going to do, because the purpose of the sunflower will be for beehives, pretty much strictly beehives. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to plant it here isolated. And once it's done, then I don't have to risk like um, having it be accidentally harvested, you know. And then, yeah, there we go. I have wheat to grow at a later date. Okay. I got my stuff done early. Don't have money. Um, it's time to go do crab pots. I don't have much energy left, but that being said, I can't eat. So, give me a sec. Um, I'm going to put these away in the mining because I don't really need them. Put this away here because I don't need to carry that. Alright, I'm heading out. I'll start with the river and 
catch some fish there that um, is exclusive to the season. I'm just gonna make sure as well that this southern exit is like nice and clear. It still is. Alright. Okay, that's one to the harvest. I mean, foraging thing. Alright, this'll do. So let's look at the fish. What is in the forest? Um, rainbow trout. But that's also mountain lake, so we can get rainbow trout here. Dorado, which it's in tool. Dorado is probably the important one. Okay, so that's till 7 p.m. It's just those two. Rainbow trout. Oh, bike as well, but that one's pretty common. All right. I'm going to get some wood so then I can set up a chest for the storage of crab pot related things. I don't usually fish off here because it seems to be bad, but for now, since it's close, don't want to potentially waste time. Yeah, this is why. It should still work, it's just probably not as reliable. Um, one other thing I forgot to check. That one, this one. Okay, so I mean all the salmon berries I gathered are gonna be used. I'll take a trip. Let me just double check Elliot that he. Because he was weird with the flower last time. He dislikes Daffodil. Doesn't say anything about this, so I think it should be fine. This is one of these friendships that I just don't work on that often, so it's like, hey, you're here. There we go. Oh, come on. <laughs> Give me the fish. Okay, there's Pike. Just give me a minute. The unfortunate thing is because I got the salmon berry bundle stuff, it means I won't be able to hang on to it as a food source. So I'm gonna have to adjust. That's a good find. I got a diamond. But then also I got my um, first book. So these books are new in 1.6. 
And when you find them, they can either give you a skill or they give you experience to a particular um, skill. But I just got mining increase. Without mining. So that's nice. I'm going to hang on to that diamond and not donate it because I know that the sturgeon want diamond as one of the first things they ask for. So I keep my first diamond for that reason. Second diamond he can have. First diamond will be uh for, for that. Um, okay. It's still 7 p.m. I can catch that fish. There's Leah. I'm gonna give her <laughs> the uh, the spring onion. Uh, get rid of that. We got plenty of these over time. Here you go, Leo. Okay, that was strange. <laughs> I don't know why it aimed that way. Okay, well, there's no point in fishing here now. Because I think that's it for the fish that I can get. I mean, I can still get a fish, it's just not the exclusive ones. So I need to try for Dorado again tomorrow. Okay. So Pike isn't a bundle fish, so I'm just going to hang on to one of them, just in case it comes up in a quest. The other one I can get rid of. Okay, um... So, what I'm going to do... I'm just going to set up a little spot here. I put paving down so then it kind of safeguards against weeds growing. Do this, and then any crab pot stuff is going to go in here. Or stuff that I want to smoke. Turn into sashimi or smoke. Which smoking comes in later. Um, so let me check the values of these. Okay, so sunfish can only get me 60 at the moment. So that goes in. What about pike? Pike is a good fish that sells well. Keeping it. Um, chub. I'm not sure I kept a second chub. Bream I know sells well. Okay. Gotta be careful here. Not, there we go. Not destroy the trees by accident. I'm gonna go drop off some bundle stuff um, while I'm here. Okay, so I do have two chop, that's fine. Um, put that in the... Um, keep one pike. I'm pretty sure I kept a bream inside, so that's fine. Sell that. Um, hang on to the diamond, that. Okay, so what I can take at the moment. Yep, so these are required. I think I just need to take 60, if I'm not wrong. I'll double check. Fifty and ten. Okay, cool. Um
Okay, I think job is something. That one. Okay. Um, I have cookies. That's going to be part of the children's bundle. I don't think there's anything else I can take. Diamond is apparently one, but like we're hanging on to that for now. All right, I'll do. I'm gonna go to the ocean and um, also top up the crab pots there. I should have enough time to get both of these things done. I might have a little time left over for uh, fishing as well. We'll see. Okay, so forages bundle, that's done. The cookie. These get sold. So I can just buy the ice cream and finish this bundle. Unless I learn the recipe, which... Yeah. And the last one goes into foraging. Okay. Right, that's crops. Foraging is here. All right, good start. I forgot to put the worm bin down, but that's okay. Okay, good. No, these make good gifts, so. That being said, I do need to hang on to one to make sure I craft summer seeds. Okay. No luck here today. Okay, so I mean, there's a little bit of time. making sure there was nothing over there. I need to remember I need to catch another eel when it's raining as well. That's a halibut. That's going to get sold. One more. Just want a little bit of extra money. Okay. Prime time. have to see when ice cream gets sold. Just to make sure I buy it. Because the doll I'd rather keep. It's like a museum donation thing.
All right, so that's set up for tomorrow. Put crab pot stuff in there. I'm going to transfer all the crab pot stuff in there, so then it's, it's just all set. Okay, and the queen of sauce. Pretty sure I did check in the morning. But just check at night, just in case. Glowstone ring. Transmute to iron, which it's not bad. I think given this map gives you extra copper, it's probably worth doing that. All that means is just converting copper to iron. Oh, I didn't sell the fish. Oh well, it doesn't matter. I can sell it today. It's not like I can, I can buy my animals today anyway, so that's fine. The halibut goes... I'll see what I'm missing to be able to to craft. But I do want to make a beehive, so. Oh, nice, this is done. Excellent. Now this is like a closer water supply. And I can get started on the sturgeon pond. Okay. So, take the sturgeon. Okay, I can, I can make it. I'm pretty sure I can make it. Um... Iron bar. Coal. Bee house. Excellent. It's a good source of income. Um, can I make the sign still? No. I need 15 more wood. Okay. Whenever you do one of these, just you make a sign. Alright, in you go. So now I've got a supply of bait. I'm going to start my crab pot money making. Ooh, it does give iron. Okay. some wood. Okay. Alright, we're covered. I gotta make sure I'm taking advantage of, like, what this map offers. Okay, uh, so I need to construct a sign. And you just place the sign there. So now I know how many are in there. Right, 
So my aim is going to be just put beehives around the whole thing. That's up and running. All right. Oh, I forgot to water the pet's bowl. I am trying to be good with this. <laughs> I always forget. I'm gonna get these cracked open the clints. Okay, this watering can can go in there. Do I have anything? I don't think I have anything else to donate for now. Alright. So I'm going to go down here to try and fish out the Dorado so then I don't have to think about the river fish anymore. Get that out of the way. And then depending on the time, today is like an exercise day, so there's going to be a bunch of people doing that. So I'll pop into Piers. give her something but like I was waiting for it to do that I have a spring onion <laughs> such an easy easy friendship okay hang on to that Easier. Is he gonna stand where I am? No, okay. Well, next to me. Oh yeah, right, rainbow trout. Well, I need a couple of these, I think, for recipes, so. Damn, it doesn't want to give me the Dorado. I'm hanging on to the Deluxe Bait for now. But it is better to use Deluxe Bait in Crab Pots. Am I really not going to get this Dorado? <laughs> I don't know how rare it is. I did want to go to Clint's, but I might not be able to. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Please let this be it. I'm going to double check after this cast, like what time it stops at. Okay, not this one, because time's still going to progress. I mean, that's nice. Okay, 
Okay, what is going on here? Dorado until 7 p.m. in the Cindersap Forest River, which is here. I've just been unlucky. <laughs> the person appeared. Alright, I'm in the right place. It's here till 7. The exercise is probably over by now as well. It's okay, I can pivot on my plans. This is why buying the Sturgeon, though it's available in this season, is not such a bad call. I don't have to rely on RNG and I can focus on other things at hand. If it's anything like this Dorado, it's just like you're at the mercy of RNG. Please, please let this be it. <laughs> Still not it. Okay, that's for a bundle. No, this is good. This is good. Um, I should probably drink this just to make room. It also gives me a little energy. mind getting these. <laughs> I think I got maybe two more chances at best. I have, to fo I have to focus on getting this fish, otherwise I'll forget. Really? Really? Come on! Oh, alright. Yeah, that's, that's the last one I can go for. Yay! <laughs> Literally. <laughs> The last cast of the day. Okay. Put the Dorado. I'll hang on to it, just in case it comes up in a quest. Speaking of quests, I'm gonna go to town and check on the board and just see if I got anything I can do. Alright, let's pop by here. Um, any low value fish are gonna go in here. Let me check on the rainbow trout itself. Okay, rainbow trout sells well, so that's fine. We don't need to put it in there. Um, 
Give me a sec. I'm also gonna look up. How many rainbow trout do I need? The wiki has a list of just individually how many of each item you need to keep. So then you've cooked one of every recipe. One rainbow trout, okay. And how much does rainbow trout sell for? Rainbow trout is a low value fish, I believe. No, no it's not. Sell it. Better off selling it. Okay, cool. Um, I guess check the chub while I'm here. Chub, yeah, it, it evens out. It's like, sell that chub. It's the same as cooking it. Okay. I've looked up what I need to look up. Okay, so into the cooking chest, we put in one rainbow trout. Okay, one pike, one dorado. Um, the rest can get sold. Actually, no, right, keep one rainbow trout as well, just in case it comes up in the quest. And then the rest can go. Let's just see I have a chub. I do. Okay. Take out all the crab pot stuff, but leave one of each, just in case it comes up in a quest. Um, put stuff away that I don't need at the moment. That's a bundle thing, so I'm going to put it here so I don't mistake it. Okay. Yeah, once this chest has enough items in there, then I'll make a cook stove thing, outdoor one, <laughs> outdoor cooking, and just turn it all into sashimi. Okay, there is a quest. What's it gonna be? Looking for a gold bar, Evelyn. And I got a ticket for it. Worth it, I have a gold bar. They seem to be taking all my gold ore <laughs> right away. Um, those cookies will probably go to Jazz. I imagine she likes them. I'll have to take a look. Her birthday is not tomorrow but the day after how are we doing i think what i needed from this was just i need a muscle that's the only thing i need and then i can move these crab pots to be with the others and then i don't have to come down here if i don't want to all right so the dorado's out of the way i'll look towards the uh, ocean fish tomorrow. Just get that stuff out of the way so then can focus on whatever it is needs doing. This hour, it's probably all I'm going to be able to catch. Mm. 
You move down. Last cast, because I don't have the energy, and might take a look down here quickly, too. Wow, it's empty. Okay. That's surprising. Do I have anything to give him? No, but I'll just talk to him. It's a friendship I want to get going, so then I get my blue chickens. Okay, so into the crab pot box, I'm going to put all this junk in here. I'm going to store my bait in there. Okay, sell so the halibut. Um, so always be smelting. And doing stuff. <laughs> so recycling. And also, um, see if I can smell anything. Okay, I can make another gold bar, so that'll make up for the fact that I'm getting rid of one tomorrow. And... I guess let's make another... Copper bar. Alright. Nothing to see here. So, when it says there was an earthquake during the night, um, it means the spa is now open in the north. So, there's a way to replenish energy. You just have to go up there. Nothing special about it. Source rerun tomorrow. Okay, so there's rain tomorrow. Alright, so I can plan around that. Hey, Star, how's it going? Right, Lewis and his lucky purple shorts. I mean, you can do this to get money, but it's funnier if you don't. But you need to be friends with Marnie to be able to do that anyway. Alright, I need to take a gold bar out. Um, I might pop a lot, pop by Clint's quickly. And take this with me too. Okay, good to hear. Um, I'm alright. Not so much a long day today, like yesterday. So I'm just getting more time in with my single player file. The other thing that's hard... It's like once you get the cave with stuff in it, just remembering to go in there, it's just... You don't have to go in there every day, but 
I guess that's part of the problem is like you don't have to go in there every day so you kind of get into this mindset of just forgetting and not remembering the last time you went in but bats are gonna drop fruit for me in there so I should check whenever I can okay put this away um I can probably put away the gold spring onion because Leah's already gotten two gifts What else am I going to do today? I could drop this off, so then it's like not dangerous that I accidentally get rid of it. Hey Seth, how's it going? Alright. Uh, that's enough bait to cover me for the beach. Put these in here. I'll just go throw this in the recycler immediately. Actually, that's one change I can make. I'm gonna move the recycler over there because it kind of makes sense to do that. So take all the garbage. Oh, it's, yeah, a little, little station. Okay, I think I'm set. So now I don't have to go to the river, because I've gotten all the fish from there. Oh, actually. I'm gonna go buy animals. I'm hoping Marnie can give me an animal today. First day of the season, couldn't because she was, well, I was preparing. Second day, she does exercise, so it's like, this is the earliest I can get it. Let me just double check as well. Jazz's birthday is tomorrow, not today. Okay. Yeah, so, I mean, Shane's whole story is just... Like, he acts like an ass to you, but it's because... this. I just, you know, use my watering can on him, that's fine. What's the matter with you? All you do anymore is mope around your room and drink beer. And muddy footprints as well. You don't understand. He also has uh, a Sega. What's your plan? Don't you ever think about the future? Plan? Hopefully I won't be around long enough to need a plan. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of... There's a lot of serious things that happen in this game. As chill as it may be, there's just hints of things. Okay, um... Yeah, here's the thing. If I buy a cow, I won't be able to milk it. But then again, I can't milk it right away, so... Does anyone want to come up with a name for the cow? Or do I just, like... Snernerd? What, what is... Some of the random names. Tish. Teka Bella. Snabo. Rook. Goo. Boki. Wemmy. What are these names? Jotani? Snapper? Sutsas? Kitsas? Mineo? Grumbo? Gungus? <laughs> Pokabo? Shawley? 
Well, I don't know how the, the random name generator works, but like, I think it just takes two words and slaps them together. Go Moom, Go Moomo, Promona, Sheku. Now, Pook, Pook, Puckus. <laughs> That's, I mean, Latoni, Prepus, Sotsoze, Snoo, Goalie, Wep. Maybe I should just go like from Rocco's Modern Life. I'm just going to do that. And now I need to earn a thousand to get uh, the ability to be able to milk. Oh, you know, I should have bought feed. It's kind of a... It is going to rain tomorrow, so I'm going to need feed. Otherwise, cow will be annoyed at me. <laughs> I have enough for two days. Two days of food. There's the dirt bag himself. Hello, I left my shorts in the bedroom of another villager. Can you go get them for me? Okay, um, Evelyn Gold Bar. There we go, and I got a prize ticket for that. Thank you. I'm doing quite well with these. Done the vast majority of them. Demetrius wants a hot pepper. See, so this is an example of one of these quests where it's not possible to do this. I kind of wish that it would it would take that into account, but there's no way at this point you'd be able to do this unless you bought it from the traveling merchant. Because it's day three, there's, you wouldn't have a crop in time to do this. It's kind of annoying, and it's something that I thought that would have been changed at some point, but here we are. You'll get those from time to time. It's not a whole lot you can do about it. It's just let it go. Ooh, mushroom logs are coming up. That's good. So, I can't process geodes because I'm out of money. I think they cost 50 and I, I just don't have 50. I may as well talk to people while I'm here. Be social. Okay, Penny doesn't have much friendship points. I need to work on that. Jazz will be fine after tomorrow. But I'm doing better than I usually do. Like, most people have one heart, except these two. They're kind of a pain. I was gifting the dwarf stuff to see if it, the friendship would go up before learning the language, but I don't think it does. But it's not like it was costing me much to do that anyway, because those quartz crystals, they're really common. Twenty-five. Okay, hang on. I can't sell. Never mind. I'm four gold shy. That's unfortunate. I need to somehow make four gold. I'll talk to Demetrius. I'm going to give this to Harvey because... Oh, no, Caroline. Caroline said... That's a more important friendship than Harvey. Harvey was just because... 
It's another one of those villagers that I just... It's hard to interact with them just because of how they operate. Okay, um... So I'm going to go fishing on the beach and try and get whatever I can out of there. Tomorrow, after giving a present to Jazz, I'm going to focus on the mines because then I'll have my... I'll hopefully have enough. Oh, okay. That's nice. Food for the mines tomorrow. I'm at a good time here because I can get the puff fish potentially. Okay, that's a bundle fish, but I think I've already donated it. I think I can get most of these fish. Did I wrap up today earlier? I did, yeah. Just because Monday and Tuesdays are like my longer days. So Wednesday I, I get my stuff done quickly and just... Spend a bit of time just chilling. Man, it's not giving me any other fish. I was hoping for one of the other ones. He's going to complain that I'm in this spot. Oh no, maybe not. Well then, I wanted money, I got money. I guess I can donate that diamond to the museum. Finding one of those early on is, pr is a pretty big deal. It's like multiple days worth of income. Me 
me have a look at the fish list. Uh, yeah, so puffer fish is gone. That's tuna can appear until 7 p.m. Um, I got red mullet. Red snapper doesn't happen until it's raining. Super cucumber apparently happens in the evening, but I haven't found one. Okay. Tilapia is like an early morning fish, so I need to be here earlier. Alright. Noted. But I think that one can happen when I go for the legendary fish. I'm just trying to get the ones that are, I guess, common-ish out of the way. Whilst I still need money. With tuna, I think I need three. <laughs> One for bundle and then two for cooking, if I'm not wrong. Oh, there you go. That's that. Oh, almost lost it. What is, what is it doing? Alright, cool. Two of them. I'll check which ones I sell and which ones I convert into sashimi. I think now it's just going to be the same fish over and over again. Talibut, right? Yeah. Okay. Talk to you just to get some friendship up. Need to be careful not to accidentally <laughs> give him this. I'm still going to go to the mines tomorrow. don't have lightning rods, so the problem that happens when thunderstorms occur is, like, your crops can get struck by lightning, which is really sad. They, they can, uh, be destroyed. Uh, get rid of the crash, it's fine. Okay. Just have to hope that it doesn't happen. That's why mining is kind of good early on, because if you fight as you mine, you can get to a point where you have your lightning rods before the storms hit.
Ooh, almost lost it. Okay, got it. This will be the last cast. All right, fine. We'll see if I can catch anyone leaving the saloon. Okay, there's a few people in here. I try and squeeze in talking to people wherever I can. Alright, put away this stuff. So, again, just in the interest of keeping one of every fish, just in case they ask for it. Alright, let me look at the fish list. I just want to see, like, what I should keep and what I should convert. Um, red mullet. That's a cell. Okay, I think all of these are sell. So that makes it easier. Yep, they're all sell. Okay. Quickly put the feed in the barn. <laughs> There's like one more task to do now. Which is greet the cow. Yeah! <laughs> Look at that money. Holy crap. It's actually really good. Okay, before I start the next day, I just need to do something really quick. But I'll pause the VOD so then it's just like instantaneous on YouTube later. There we go. I can continue now. Yeah, um... It was just something related to the apartment, but then it was... <laughs> Long story short, they replaced the gates here, so they were like, oh, you need to get your remotes reprogrammed. So I called to set that up, and then they were like, oh, actually, you don't need to get it reprogrammed. It doesn't affect your building. It's like, oh, okay, well, that was a waste of time. So, all good. Just figured I'd set that up sooner rather than later. Because I imagine there's going to be like a queue of people doing exactly that. Alright, as part of the morning class, doing this.
Oh, Ooh, that's bad. I can't reach that pot from here. Why? Um. So here's something that is new in this patch is you can move things. Or chests, at least, by doing that. But it still didn't give me the reach I need. Kind of annoying, but okay. I'll go to Marnie's. Because I need to purchase the milk pail. But then also I'm going to buy another cow. It is Jazz's birthday. Hold on, I can't even go to Marnie's yet. I just remembered. Um, let me do some random stuff around the farm. It's still closed. Just... Oh, there we go, cool. I'll move the recycle thing. Or even the crab pot. Back. I'm just going to move the crab pot. I think it's better if I do that. And there we go. Because I want to keep this this way. Okay. Let me get a present for Jazz. I'm worried that I won't be able to interact with her right away. That is the fear I have. Um, let me have a look. Okay, so... Whoa, she has a lot of conditions with her schedule. When it's raining, in a bedroom, stands in the entryway to the shop. Alright, so she's going to be in her bedroom until at least 11 in the morning. So I have no way of interacting with her until 11. Um... Daffodil, fairy rose. Okay, I guess this is a daffodil. It's like the best I can do right now. Alright, that's fine. Interesting. Oh, crap. Hang on, I did the wrong thing. Not this chest. Uh, alright. I might do like a... I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do like a present loop. That's my last daffodil. Hang on. Universal like. Oh, no, that works. I can give her this. Because that counts as a flower and it's a universal like. With a couple of exceptions. That'll work. Um, I can go give a leak to George. Uh, I mean, I guess give this out as well. Alright. I'll just go to town and do like some, some gift deliveries whilst 11am happens. Oh, cool. That's another thing I can do. I'm also gonna... I like to put torches randomly behind objects so then it creates ambient lighting at night. So then you can see what you're doing. <laughs> as long as you don't put it in the way of villages, it's generally fine. Harvey first, because it's hard to talk to him at times. Then I'll go to Pierre's. It's the same quest as yesterday, right? Oh, no. New one. Iron bar. Right, taking it. <laughs> like... Actually get to play this and not skip it. This is also one of the most difficult achievements in the game. Um, but you'll see. 
Also, shout out to the Chrono Trigger poster in the background. You scared me sneaking into my room like that. Ugh, I've been so busy playing Journey of the Prairie King for hours and I can't finish the first level. The game is ridiculously hard. Well, either that or I'm just terrible at it. Hey, do you want to try and this level together with me? I think I might do better with your help. If this is, if the game is anything like Battletoads, having a second player is a liability. But anyway, this is something that you will never see in multiplayer. Who's go who's going to play this in multiplayer? You have one round of it, like the whole day is gone. Good upgrade. Okay. Speaking of other games and achievements. <laughs> ah, um, Vampire Survivors is getting another DLC, so rip my 100%. And Risk of Rain 2 is also getting another update. R rip my 100%. So I'm going to have to get those again. I'm excited for the Risk of Rain 2 update, though it's minor, it's still, still gonna be cool. I like that game a lot. Why'd you put me back outside? I got stuff to do. A bunch of stuff got announced today, so... Um, alright, let's talk to Caroline. Oh. Never mind. Okay. Not quite time for that yet. Alright, admittedly I'm gonna be a little late. That's okay. Talk to her now. George, you get a leak. Granny, you get flower. Okay, now just go back to jazz. I... I really, really hope that none of my crops get struck by lightning. <laughs> it's going to be sad otherwise. Okay, uh, there's Jazz. Does anyone want to come up with a, cat, a name for a cow? You have like... Next, I don't know, 15 seconds. Brussy? Brot? Noka? Trabel? Batu? Bessie? Alright. Sure. Better than... <laughs> What's the one that basically had, uh... You know what, I'm not gonna say it. Oh, that's a typical cow name, yeah.
Oh yeah, I need to go to the ocean and check on my crab pots. It's okay, I've still got some decent time in the mines, just... Split responsibilities. Okay. Um, one, two, three, and let's go. I just want to get the last thing I need. Okay, Emily wants an iron bar. I can give her that right away. Oh yeah, the scene. This is funny. How is clean under the cushions? It's your turn this week. You're being childish, Haley. I do the majority of the work in this house, and you know it. Oh, it's that new farm boy. He has a name, you know. Hey, I bet you'll understand my point of view here. <sighs> I'm really sorry to involve you in this. Haley is complaining because I asked her to clean under the cushions. It's only because I cleaned them last week. <laughs> Stop whining! Pick the high road. This, this is such a ridiculous thing, but just watch. Why not have this be your one weekly task? Alright, you win. I guess this can be my job every week then. And there won't be any reason to argue over it. Thanks, that was a great solution. Man, if that's really all I have to do in one week... <laughs> oh, okay. Guess there's a second scene. Imagine only having to clean under the cushions every week. Sure. <laughs> this is worthwhile. Okay, stock up the crab pots and drop this off, and then we're good. It sucks that that doesn't count as. Yeah, it doesn't count. It only counts when you get it in a crab pot. Anyway. There's a difference between foraging and catching. want to drop this off so then I don't forget about it. Alright, it's just grapes now. I didn't put my water in can away. It's okay. Oh, crap. Well, we'll see how this goes. All right, 
so one thing I'm gonna do, which is something that isn't really made obvious, unless you tune into that TV station that gives the tips, but even then it's just like... I need clay, and the only way to get clay really is just to dig up soil. When you're in here, and there's soil around, you can dig into it, and then it'll have the potential to dig up clay, but also artifacts for the museum. I don't really resort to it, but I need to get a silo set up so then I can put feed for the animals, so it needs to happen. I think I'm unfortunately in the set of floors that isn't going to have much soil. I'm going to try not to use the Autumn's Bounty because that would have to be someone's favorite food. I guess I've been here before. But for the rest of this week, there's nothing else to worry about. They've gotten all the birthdays sorted. So I'm choosing to fight this thing because bat wings are used for lightning rods for whatever reason. I don't know. And just, uh, yeah. Getting bat wings. Yeah, I mean, storage upgrade would be nice, but like, I'm gonna try and hold off on it as much as I can. I'm gonna ignore that because I think it takes. Okay. Never mind. If I can fight all three at once, then. Four at once. Holy crap. Come here. Group them up. Now this is worthwhile. I mean, it makes sense. A wooden sword shouldn't do much to stone. I get it. <laughs> but still. Hey, Messiah. Thanks for the, uh, the prime sub. Appreciate it. How's it going? Okay, consume onion. I should be able to make it 40. Oh, it's just a slingshot. Never mind. All right, listen. This is a weapon that you can do to do range attacks, but the thing that I dislike the most about it is that it uses stone, and stone is just a valuable resource that you're going to constantly need. So it's like... Yeah. It's not great. Into the trash. It's not worth that much money, so... We have reached the iron floors now. Tired from work, oh. Uh, 
I, I feel that a bit. Though it's not as light for me. I heard a bat. It's not like it's coming anytime soon. Okay, this is what I was after. Um, I need to make a sacrifice. Now, you know what? I know what I can do. Just eat the rest of these. And then that'll let me carry that. Because that is required in the bundle. Also gonna hit this rock just to get extra stone out of it. Oh man, there's so many of these little dudes. Hey, Slayer, thanks for the, uh, raid. Appreciate it. Sorry, I'm like, <laughs> mid-combat. May have to donate that tomorrow. Or the day after. Coffee bean! Um... Yeah, get rid of this, because, like, that's a 75 gold thing. Okay. Leave, leave, leave. I need to make time to plant this coffee bean. That's, that's a big deal. Alright, I got the frozen tier, so that's one more step towards minecarts. Did I know Star Slayer is great at Guitar Hero? I haven't seen her play, no, but... I have seen her play rhythm games, and yeah, definitely, definitely good at them. <laughs> Can't say the same about myself. Coffee bean goes down. That's not the same. I mean, I played Guitar Hero once, got a friend's house, like a long time ago. Mm, that's probably like a dumb risk. There were grapes out there, but it's just too late. Okay. Traveling Merchant Day. We check the weather forecast. Sunny day tomorrow. Did anything get struck by lightning? It doesn't look like it. I think everything's fine, surprisingly. Spaghetti for Gus. You don't play rhythm games as much anymore. Ah, but I'm sure it's like riding a bike or something similar I don't know like I think even if you stopped playing for 10 years and you came back to it for one day you'd still be better infinitely better than me
But I put those seeds oh, over here. So, I mean, wheat is easy. Um, I don't think just straight up wheat is used in cooking, but I'll double check. Let me have a look. Oh, apparently I need two periwinkles, not just one. And two shrimp. Okay. Um... Yeah, straight up wheat is not used. Okay. So I can just sell this. Um, what about mussels? Are mussels used? I'm trying to stay on top of everything. One mussel for fish, fish stew. Sorry that I'm missing out on a lot of chat. At the start of the day in Stardew, man, I just, I have to think and plan out what I'm doing, because otherwise I'm just running around town aimlessly. And I get nothing done. I'm also... Like, mentally preparing for what I'm gonna have to do in Hollow Knight soon. Like, that's... that's next. Okay, so... Two periwinkle. Um... I have bait with me. Guess I should go to Gus's? Not Gus's, um... I'm blanking out on names. This is how you can tell. My brain is, like, dead after work. Um, Gunthers. Jeez. They both start with a G. <laughs> but I'm also going to drop off anything I might have bundle-wise. Wait. Tried Suicide Squad kills the Justice League. I haven't heard of that game. What am I forgetting? I'm forgetting something. What am I forgetting? I'm forgetting something. There's something that I'm supposed to take to the bundles. But for the life of me, I can't remember. Diamond, right. Yeah, but I need it. Okay, no, no, it's fine. Let it go. Alright, um, always be smelting, so two bars go on. Okay. I should probably purchase some f more food. I didn't purchase the milk pail, did I? I didn't. Ooh, that's what I forgot. Okay. I knew I knew I forgot something. Um, okay. Three bait. Bring these with me. That's all fine. Alright, I'm off. Finally. So Ooh, wait a minute. Okay. <laughs> I'm not off. What are the crops first? Let 
I'm gonna struggle in Hollow Knight. Alright, now I can go. You beat the new South Park game? How is that game? I've seen it pop up a few times, but... I haven't played any of their games. The last ones I played were the really old ones that were kind of shovelware. Whole one and, uh... Okay, nothing of interest today. It's great, it would be easier for a team. Oh, okay, so it's better in co op. Okay, purchase the milk pail and then. I mean, I'm gonna get. That should hopefully be enough, just in the short term. I'm also going to pick up Lewis's shorts. <laughs> I'm not going to give them back to him. But there's this whole just underlying plot where Lewis is hooking up with Marnie and for whatever reason, he's just dropping massive hints that that's the case. Like between getting you to fetch his shorts out of her room and just, I'm convinced there's a, this note that you find later that points out, like, the exact spot where they're gonna hook up. Um... I'm convinced he wrote that note. I don't know. I think he's an exhibitionist. Or there's just something about the idea of getting caught that just, um... You know... Does it for him. Otherwise, why, why would you ask a random stranger to go get your shorts out of someone else's bedroom. It, it makes no sense. It doesn't really change the embarrassment level. It's like, she probably knows it's your shorts. And later on, he asks for truffle oil and he's like, don't ask me what it's for. What do you mean, don't ask me what it's for? Cop. Um, get to keep the fish. Alright, that's easy enough. Okay, I'm gonna go buy Gunther's. The moment you, uh, you just say stuff like that, like, hey, don't ask me what I'm gonna use it for, I don't know. It's, go it's going to be a weird thing. You don't need to. You don't need to say it. Nice. Okay, I mean, they all can't be winners. Spaghetti. Corn. Good for next season. I can probably plant some now. Maple bar. Coffee? Okay. This initial last lot of coffee I'm probably going to use as presents. I'm hoping he's going to sell ice cream because that'll... That'll help. Um, donate to museum. One of these. One of these. I'm trying to keep things neat. But obviously that's a lost cause. I'm going to have to organize them later. Just pictures. Don't, don't worry about pictures. Are you setting up your ice cream sort? You are. Okay, and that'll finish that bundle too. Cool. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, wait, no. That's fine. I've already... That's fine. I've already donated it. Okay, I thought I made a mistake.
Damn it, I'm gonna have to go back. So outside of this, the way I usually play this is in the first year, I, I'm outside of the person that I want to marry, I do not bother with socializing at all. Like I just straight up focus on making money and getting my farm up and running. Because you look at it now just in terms of time management, it's already 2pm and I'm still kind of going around doing little odd jobs. That's the thing about this game, is just how quickly time goes by. Uh, I don't have anything to give Granny. Too late to go into the doctor's office. Let's see if he's up here. I heard a door open. Probably him. Oh wait. Let's not. I mean, making two trips, bad idea. Okay, so. Children's bundle completed. What do I even get for this? Oh, yes! Okay, no, that's great. I actually needed a battery and I don't have a lightning rod, so... That's a big deal. That is a huge deal. Because now I can donate this. Two furnaces. Ah, that's not bad. Okay, so I just need to find three more of these gems. Just three more gems. And then I get minecarts. Like, really, really early minecarts. Um, hold on. Yeah, so it has to be one of these. I mean, I could donate the diamond, but I don't want to. Okay, but no, this is good. I think this will definitely... If, if I can get it in the next few days, it's the earliest I've ever gotten minecarts. And minecarts are just big, because then you can spend more time in the mines, and also it's just quicker to get around. So, big deal if I can get it quick. Yeah, okay, I mean, huh? what else have I got? Okay, I'm on top of most of the stuff. Uh, nothing crop-wise to deliver, so we can go home. I'll go put away all this stuff. It also means I can create sprinklers, um... Not yet, but the next one up. Then that'll mean I don't have to water my crops and... It'll be... Much better. I guess while I'm here... I think it might be... Ugh. I mean, I guess it's never too late, but... I haven't spent much time... All right, I'll just, I'll just do it. If I can find the gems I'm missing, minecarts priority. Okay, uh... All right, because I'm lazy. We're all gonna go here. I'm doing this exactly so that I don't have stuff here in my backpack. We've got a piece of coal. Okay. Alright, coffee is going to be present. That's going to be present. I'm going to keep a stack of five here. These are going to be presents for the dwarf later.
Oh yeah, maple bar as well. Go in there. Battery can go in here. Seeds can go in here. Leave the watering can. Okay. I do have a quest to catch carp, but I'm probably going to tackle that tomorrow. I think it's almost time to do like a a selling of this stuff. Okay. I can leave that going, it's fine. Very quickly, we're gonna go in here. Because I don't really have much energy left. In you go. No, stay. <laughs> Just wanted to be on the edge. Naked time. All right. I'm going to take off this hat. My character's supposed to be designed around Chrono from Chrono Trigger, but the hat is just making me look like a clown with the the red shoes I've got on. I guess they're going to change eventually, but at the moment, it just seems very, very clown-like. Why does he go behind... What does he do there? I've never seen him go behind the bush like that. Okay. Weird. Alright. Aim for progress. That's a low level hammer, so I guess just sell it if possible, otherwise just ditch it. Wait, no, it's not. What the hell? 15 to 24? Oh, no, this is, like, an enchanted one? I mean, I don't really like using weapons out of outside of the sword, but when it's doing that much damage, holy crap. It's kind of hard to ignore. Haven't really seen a floor with soft soil again. Okay, this is probably as far as I'm gonna be able to get.
Nice. Okay. <laughs> Do more. One more. Wait, if I give the diamond, I can get my... Oh, that is tempting. I won't be able to do it today, because by the time I go home... I'll think about it. It's probably worthwhile, but... Alright, I gotta go. Hmm. The minecart or not to minecart? The thing is... The diamond is going to make it so the sturgeon give me... Row, and then I can start processing that row. And it'll make it'll make a lot of money. But then minecarts in general let me travel a lot more and have more time on my hands. So it's like what do I do? I have to think this through very carefully. I'm leaning more towards not getting the minecarts yet. Okay, these are presents. These are also presents. Um, oh crap, I didn't grab enough all. Saturday. Uh oh. All right. Well, I know what that is. Tomorrow is the big uh, fancy storm, which is something that I'm gonna have to go around. So there's no mining tomorrow. I guess I'll go hammer. That's like fine. Okay. Seems like I got multiple pepper. Not a bundle item. So I'm gonna sell the gold ones and then keep the others. And these are gonna serve as presents for Lewis. That's my first lot of honey. So this low tier... Oh, there it is. Yep. <laughs> right on schedule. It's like... Minecarts or the fish pond. The fish pond is probably better. Got a new. Uh, but yeah, once I get kegs, I can make meat out of it, and it's just better than just selling this honey. I'll just store that there. Okay, uh, I watered the sunflower, right? Pretty sure I did. So, sadly, and if I would have known, I would have kept the one I donated to the museum. I didn't donate, I didn't water this. 
Okay. But that's the hardest one to do. We'll have to look up what the other two are and look out for them in the Traveling Merchant, because one of them specifically can only be found in winter, I'm pretty sure. Oh, today's the cop. I need to catch the cop stuff for that quest. Okay. Wait, are these cows grown? They might be grown, hang on. No, not yet. Seeing what else I can do in the meantime. Alright, let it go. I guess what, well, since I'm going to town, keep up with the deliveries for George. Bring a pepper for Mayor Lewis. I'll carry one of these for the Edgelord. <laughs> um, maybe Sam. Coffee for Harvey. Okay. I got, got my stack. I'm gonna have to try and do this cop thing as quick as possible. Quest, what is it? Okay, that's probably gonna happen naturally anyway. He's not here. Where is he? He's not standing to the side here. Is he up here? This is why... <laughs> this, this is just one of the lowest relationships I have. He's probably at the library. Um... It's just, he runs the doctor's office, it closes at three, and sometimes he's just not even there. So you really have to go out of your way to look for him. You still laugh every time I call him the edgelord. Well, he takes literal frozen tears and stands out in the rain, like... <laughs> he's... Come on. If his parents w weren't, like, alive, he would be the perfect origin story to, like, Batman. I don't- I mean, he does hang out in his apartment, but... He also does this, so let's just see. Yep, there he is. I didn't even need to- I didn't even need to find him! <laughs> didn't even need to find him. Just what happens when you try to stay on top of things. It's like, when you're actually on top of things, you unnecessarily do things. If I try to kill off Robin, you'll riot. I'm not gonna try and kill off Robin, I'm just saying if some unfortunate event led to the death of his parents, he's already halfway to Batman.
He's probably in his room right now. He's not- he's not even in his room, where is he? You kidding the times I'm trying to make friends here? I think he's hanging out with Sam. Anyway. Let's just try and... How many cop... Oh, crap. That was my fault. So I'll finish Sunday up and then... And go beat my head against that brick wall. That is Hollow Knight. The thing is, fishing can still get me gems, so it's like, I could probably get the minecarts if I fish, if I'm just lucky enough with the treasure chests. So, it's not like this is completely wasting my time. This could still serve its purpose. Thankfully, it's carp. Carp are, like, easy. Alrighty, just two more. I mean, I call Sebastian Edgelord, I call Elliot the beach hipster. It's really just those two that I, I have names for. It's just the fact that fr Frozen Tears, and he's out in the rain constantly. <laughs> it's just, come on, man. Oh, that's Sturgeon. That's a bumblefish, so. So it would have been day six before I caught the Sturgeon, so, I, you know, what I did to buy the Sturgeon early, I think was still a good call. Because it's, you can get it in summer, but it's like, at least for me, by the time I get one, it's a few days in. And it's already asked for its uh, first item, so. Alright, we got minecarts. We got minecarts. <laughs> we got minecarts. It's gonna be day seven minecarts. That's a huge deal. Because that means I can stay out a little longer and get home reliably. And also getting around, ugh, just, I'm going to be saving a lot of time. So the luck was, was real. Wait, wait for it. Another book, chat. Oh, there's moss there. I should go get that moss. Mind you, tomorrow is going to be the big storm, so... Tomorrow will be a day to gather moss and nothing else. Can you please give me the two carp that I'm missing? Carp are all day, right? I'm pretty sure they are. What is fish? Give fish. Deliver the fish! It's not... What I'm after. I 
can't believe it gave me two right away, and now it's just being stingy. One more. Oh wait, no. That was the last one. We're done. Alright, I can leave here. I'm gonna go home. I'm going to do a cook-off. And I'm also going to get minecarts up and running. Also, has the edgelord returned home yet? I went out of my way to get this present. I'm going to give it for him. He has not returned. You would think he'd be on his way home. There's Demetrius. Oh yeah, I needed to talk to him. Oh. That was good. Okay. Um. I need to go back to the mine to get the slimes, so. Yeah, there you are, Edge Lord. Come here. Wow, how do you know I like tears? Thank you, it represents my state of mind and soul, man. It's a metaphor, okay? Trout is a cell. I forgot about Chub. Give me a sec. Beesh. Chub is a cell. Cop is not a cell. Uh, the sturgeon is a bundle fish. I just hang on to it because I put it here first actually. Because I don't want to accidentally, like, harvest it. Okay. That and that. That's going to the bundle. I'm just hanging on to random stuff at the moment. Um, so I need... Wood. Fiber. Tomorrow I need to go to the ocean as well, just to catch an eel. Um, cloth? Not a bundle? Okay. Just checking. Alright, that goes in. Grab the sturgeon, and off we go. I'm gonna try and get rid of the slimes in the time I have left in the day. It should be okay. Just doing the elevator reset trick should hopefully give me them. Okay. 
There we go. Yeah, I mean, I don't have a fishing rod that can take advantage of that yet. But tomorrow, um, early wake up, going to the ocean. Okay. Minecarts! a good one too for later. The quickest I've ever gotten minecarts. Nice. That is super useful. Okay, I had Go. Uh, I mean, I might be able to. Like, I need to try. It's just because tomorrow I have a lot on. Worst comes to worst, I just do mine cut travel there in the morning and just do it quickly. But I would like to spend as much time as possible. Okay. All right, uh, what, 35? Let's see, nope, 45, 45 it is, all right. Set up, but okay, this is why hammers I'm not good at them. Okay, done. And I just got another bundle item. Okay, I need to talk to Lois, but that can that can happen tomorrow. Hang on to all of that stuff. I'm gonna make a separate chest for fruits. This is going to be my, my fruit chest. With the exception of that, well, hang on. These I'm keeping specifically for Demetrius and Mario. And these are gonna be part of the fruit chest. Got my rule. Hold on. I know I'm pushing it. Um, can I smell anything? No. Okay. I'm good. Ooh. I'm gonna hang on to five of them. Then I have a food supply for tomorrow. The rest can go. But now the sashimi is going to be my food supply. Yep. 
Very good. Okay. Green rain has descended upon... Yeah. You miss out on the Queen of Source here, which is kind of annoying, but, you know, it is what it is. Alright, so, Green Rain is an event. All the, look at look at this, the trees go absolutely mental growing. And then you get moss, so... There's a couple of things I need to do today. Traveling Merchant is one. Um, we're going to go see Lewis. We'll do that. I wouldn't, I'm not going to worry about crop stuff just yet. Um, I'm going to put away, hold on. Give me a sec. I just want to see something real quick. I just want to see how much the, uh... The iridium rod costs 7,500. Okay, cool. So I can buy it. So I'm going to bring this with me. I'm going to ditch this. I'm going to bring bait with me as well. The only thing I just need to make sure is that um, nothing is going crazy. That's all. Just anything that could potentially destroy farming equipment. I just need to get rid of it. I have 35 good bait. I mean, I'll split the stack. Okay. Off we go. It's kind of annoying because I don't want to destroy grass, but at the same time. That's all right. It's a cool event. Just means you get stocked up with fiber.
Uh, pomegranate saplings too expensive. Okay. This is the other reason you want to come here. Creates a bunch of fiddlehead fern, which is used in cooking. Hopefully I'm not wasting too much time here. Which I kind of am. I did want to go try and catch some fish, but then most of the day is gone. I can still do it, it's just not going to be as planned. Like, I don't know what's better. I should probably take advantage of the rain thing, to be honest. Oh, I got a mossy seed. That's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this instead. Cause it just means next season I'm gonna get ready early. Fine, I can do what I was going to plan next time. I think it's just too good an opportunity to not do this. Later, like, late, later on, I usually struggle to have fiber, but I think now this won't be the case. Should at least go talk to Lewis. All the seeds I'm getting. <laughs> One thing you can do is sell the seeds. It's not exactly a bad strategy. I mean, at least the flower ones. I don't think I'm going to grow that many flowers. I will still go to the beach and pop up my crab pots, though. That is going to happen. Okay, into town.
Oh, this don't go anywhere. Lewis is not here. I think they're huddled in the saloon. Yeah, they're here. Okay. And I got a prize ticket. Nice. I guess since we're here. Oh, hey, yeah, I have your pep. I probably should have brought presents, but it's okay. Oh, wow. Haley is never in here. There must be meaning behind this. Nature's trying to tell us something. I'm not worried about the random shuttle pass. Situations like this where a person's character is put to the test. Cool, but very ominous. Oh, rainbow shell. Right, there's still more I can do. Um, price ticket. So whoever's birthday is next, they're going to get that tea. Continue my journey. be set next season. With the seeds I have, I don't have to buy any. So that's the thing, while it's not making me money directly, it's making me money indirectly, because it just... Oh, wow. It just means I'm not going to have to spend another book. What is it? Jack be something? Jack be thick? Gain one defense. Jack be nimble, Jack be thick. I've gained the power of thickness. Okay, see. I found more books than I found in the entire first year of multiplayer playthrough. been a very good luck run. I mean, I think it's worthwhile. How many mixed seeds? 17, that's a lot.
and 18 flower mix seeds. It's like spending about a thousand, maybe more at Pierre's. It's not bad. Cleaned up the forest as well. It's not scary. Alright, I got some more I can do around the farm as well. Like, my farm's not exactly clean. I'd say I got the most out of this. Okay, there's some up there. 188 moss, that's good. That's going to damage stuff if I'm not careful. Alright, decent. Very cool. Um, Alright, into the presence chest. I'll put this. Rainbow shell is something the fish is going to ask for at some point. Seeds going here. I'm gonna keep the res the fern. This is thinking extremely later on, but um, there's a quest that involves a lot of cooking, and this is just like a good recipe because it's just gonna involve this and rice. So it's like, just keep them all. I think I benefit more by doing that. Um, I didn't get to put the other stuff away, but that's fine. We'll just leave it be. Got the lightning rod. Okay. Well, that's an another week of this done. So, I mean, in terms of the goals that I set, I think I did all right. I kind of did better. <laughs> I got the minecarts, so minecarts are now operational. Um, got the barn with the animals set up. I got my pond going. So, a lot of progress. Alright, but I'll leave this one here for now. But if you're watching this later on YouTube, uh, thanks for sticking around to the end. Hope this beginner sort of playthrough of sorts helps in some way. Or at the very least, if you enjoy chilling with it. Either way. Um, if you do want to support any of the content over on YouTube, you can do things like click the like button, subscribe, or watch me play other things by clicking one of those videos that pop up at the end. Uh, thanks to those that do that. It does help out the channel quite a bit, so appreciate it for that. But we'll do more of this soon. 